Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, I guess. Now today, I am going over my Dinosaur King cards. My Dinosaur King arcade game cards, which people have seen in my previous videos. Well, video. I've only uploaded one video for Dinosaur King. But pretty much, someone commented on my previous video. Uh, oh, I don't think it's my pre... Pretty much my Dinosaur King arcade video I made, someone commented on it and suggested to me saying, Oh, why didn't you show off your cards? And I was like, you know what? Not a bad idea. Because in the video, you don't actually really see the cards. You only see certain ones. And now, because of that, I'm going to make this video. Now, the person that commented saying to me make the video is a person called Primal Cartman. And he suggested to me to do it so I was like you know what I will do it so I haven't got much of a big collection and when I was younger I had so many of these cards but as time went on someone slash me decided to lose them all and well that was just my younger self lost them <laughs> and it's a shame because if I had them still I would be using them for this Dinosaur King machine I found in the place near me. If you want the location for that, then just look at the comments down on my Dinosaur King video. You should be able to find where it was, because I was chatting to this other guy. I was chatting to the Primal Cartman saying where it was, so... Just just look at that, you'll find it. But pretty much, my collection is just this big. When I was younger, I had a collection like this big. But then, I lost them. <laughs> And now, since I found this machine, I've just been obviously collecting these cards all over again. So, from the beginning to the end, I guess. I don't know. And, what's it? I hope this Dinosaur King machine stays at this arcade. Because, lately, they've been replaced by this new, like, machine. This, like, rip-off machine, I'll call it. Called Animal Something. And I've seen them pop up in arcades all of a sudden. And I'm I'm not a fan of them. I'm really not. Dinosaur King cards, these things. I prefer these because they are much more amazing. So hopefully, fingers crossed, this arcade with this Dinosaur King machine stays there. And it still gives out cards. Hopefully. So now I'm going to talk about my move cards first. And then... I'm going to show everyone the dinosaurs. So, first move card. Tail Smash. One of the first moves I probably got from that machine. Technique 200, and it's a rock move. And, yeah, I guess. Series 2. All these cards are from Series 2. I've never heard anything about Series 3. But I hope they do make a Series 3. Could be awesome to see what other cards they do. Next move. Diving Press. This is quite a cool move. I think I did use it in my videos, but it is cool. Technique 800, and it's a rock move. Actually, yeah, it, shows, it tells you what they do. Yeah, this one, after smacking them with its tail, your dinosaur would do a spinning tail attack. That's cool. What's, it? What's this one? Throws dirt at your opponents, then grabs them by the neck and smashes them to the ground. Da da da. <laughs> and you got this one, Dino Swing. Technique 800, and it is a paper move. It is, it says here, bites your opponent's tail and swings them around. Yeah, it does. <laughs> it swings them around and throws them through the sky and into a rock, if I remember correctly. And this one, the Technique Boost card for a certain dinosaur, which I actually do have. I did get that dinosaur. Um,. Also, when a rock, paper, scissors, and your technique goes up, and it's a scissors move, which goes on a certain dinosaur, which I will show you in a minute, because I do have this dinosaur. In fact, the dinosaur came out before this card. This card was, like, underneath where the dinosaur was, so when I got the dinosaur, played again, and the technique card came out for it. So, can't complain. But yeah. Now, actually, if I show you this dinosaur that goes with this card, this one, here we go. 
this one is the dinosaur which goes with this as you can see right now now i've never got to use this in the actual game yet so all i know is that it just boosts your technique and obviously this is now the first dinosaur card technique 1100 strength 1000 and it is a uh I'm trying to read what this says my uh, the camera's too blurred my camera's just bad but it's a paper not paper scissors and it's a water it's a water dinosaur and it is scissors and i do not know how to pronounce that name if anyone can pronounce that name then well done to you because i cannot pronounce that but yeah there's that now let's move on to these now you got the fire dinosaur which I'm not going to be able to label any of these names, especially the last one. I'm not going to be able to label the name of that one. It is a paper, and it is a fire. And it's Technique 1000 Strength 1200. This dinosaur is actually quite a cool dinosaur to use in battle. Now, if I just show you the back. Meaning of name. Lizard of Albria or something like that. <laughs> the names they give for these things are just so complicated. Length, approx 8 meters. Where it, when it lived, can, can the period, yeah. I can't, I can't pronounce any of this. <laughs> where found, Canada, America. Dr. Taylor's comments. This doctor revels, revels the triceronions or something like that but is sleeker and lighter looking it has shorter arms and long legs so pretty much this dinosaur is like a triceratops or something like that or a t-rex i mean not triceratops this one's like triceratops i'm guessing i'm guessing this is like that i don't know but yeah t-rex type one it's quite cool this one it is an electric and it says scissors it's Technique 1000, Strength 1200. And like I say, can't pronounce that name. If you guys can, well done to you. And meaning of name. And actually, who's <sighs> I'm sorry that I can't pronounce these, okay? Length, approximately 6 meters. Where? When it lived. The same as the, the other dinosaur. <laughs> where found? America. Dr. Taylor's comments. A hyperfore, I think that says, with rough raised areas above its eyes and on its nose, with two long horns on the end of its frill? Frill? Something, I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't pronounce any of this, hey? I got some sort of dyslexia, okay? I can't pronounce these things properly. But yeah, that's that one. Now here comes the better cards. Don't know if you can see the shininess on this one, but this is quite a cool one to have. Never really used it in bounter, the no, bat bouncer, battle. That is quite a cool one to have. Um, it is a water and it is a paper. And it, now it, I can read this a counter type. I can read that. Technique 600, Strength 1600. Quite cool for a shiny thing. I think it's a bronze card, I think. I think my friend said to me it was a bronze card. Data file. Mean of name, Strong Claws. Length, approximately 10 meters. Where to live, the same as the previous dinosaurs. Where found, England. Hey, it was found in this country. Felt the Taylor's comments. A carnivore I think it says carnivore with a head like a crocodile it has huge claws on its front thumbs huh fair enough I just love these spikes that get on its back it's awesome it's an awesome card love it but yeah that's that one now this is a good one super alpha dino saw that is this is an awesome one because it's one of the Alpha Team dinosaurs, which I can remember him actually using in the actual anime for this show. His strength 500, 
not 500, Technique 500, straight 1000, it's 800, and it's a paper. And the best thing I love about this card is that it has a chance of poisoning the enemy. So in other words, if you use this in battle and you get an attack on the enemy, it can poison them. Which I never knew until I used this card. I do love this card. It was one of the first cards I got from the machine, actually. That machine, when I first played it, this is the first card I got, actually. And this was the next one. And it was this one. Then it was the Tail Smash. And then it was this one over here, which I will show you in a minute. Because it's just the best one out of all of them. Definitely the best one. And this data file. Meaning of name. Opening lizard. Length approximately 6 meters. When it lived in the same as those the other ones. <laughs> Where found? Canada and America. Dr. Z's comments. I create as many dinosaurs as I want to carry out my ambition, I think that says. Yeah, here you go. Can I poison a permit after attacking? Which is really cool, actually. Because seriously, poison damage really does help out when you're in battle. It really does. Now, here's the last one. And I, when I seen the top of this card, I flipped and went insane. Du, 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 du. Rainbow card. It says mysterious. And it is a scissors. This was the last card I got from the machine when I first ever played it. Trust me. I went insane when I got this. It is an awesome card. And if you watch the video of me playing the game, you'll see me using it. And I actually got one of its rainbow moves, which you can see in that video. So, yeah, it is a tie type. Technique 1000, strength 2000. Night thing is, though, I had another one of these. Not the same card, but I had a Raptor one. If anyone knows what that one is, then yeah. But it was a Raptor version of this with the same logo in the corner, like same shiny, all that stuff. And how I lost it was that it wasn't my fault, it was my brother. My brother thought that it would stay safe in his wallet, but then he left his wallet on the machine. So when he walked away, someone managed to grab his wallet, which had all these types of cards in, and and also had the Raptor one. Yeah, as I was saying, yeah. <laughs> I got, did I make that one then? I don't know. Yeah, it had the Raptor one in there, and all of his money and everything. And we never seen it ever again. So, yeah, that's the story of that Raptor card, which I cannot remember what it was called. Because it was when I was a really young girl, boy. Seriously, there was a holiday park I went to, and it had like four of these machines all lined up next to each other. And trust me, they were popular. <laughs> they were really popular, and they were awesome. And then it was a long period where I'd never seen them. Until this arcade I went to where I found it. And then I got this. I was so happy. Have a look at this back. Yeah. You say I couldn't pronounce all these names. Say I couldn't pronounce these names. Yeah. Try pronouncing this name. I should just, I should just go on Google. And just use the Google thing. Like, you know, the Google speech thing. To say these names. I should do that. I don't know. I don't know if I will or won't. But yeah, let's <laughs> see what Google does. Mean of name, thick headed lizard, length, approx, 8 meters. When it lived, the same as the rest of the dinosaurs. Where found, Canada slash America. Dr. Taylor's comments, a high before, which I think that says that, with a head like a helmet, its skull's thickness is about 25 centimeters thick. Ouch, definitely a bonehead, literally. If this dinosaur headbutts you, he will win. Literally, he will break your skull, he'll crush you to the ground. 
that's how powerful this dinosaur is. And I wonder if that website's still a thing. HTTP slash dinosaurking.com. I wonder if that's a website still. Who knows? I need to look it up. But yeah, that's my Dinosaur King collection. I would have a lot more if I didn't lose them when I was younger. And if my brother didn't lose the raptor version of this. Seriously, I'm annoyed about that. If any of you guys know about that card, please tell me. <laughs> but yeah, let's just go back over them again. So you got this one. This one. This one. This one. This one. This one with its technique boost. And then you got all the moves, which is Dino Swing, Dive and Press, and Tail Smash. So, yeah. Well, we're Dinosaur King cards. I hope everyone enjoyed this video, and I hope, um, I hope Prime, Primal, Primal Cartman. I think, sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong, I hope you enjoyed it too, because I'm doing this video because you suggested it to me. So, I hope everyone enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching.